Dan, thanks for joining us today. Thank you for having me. Dan, let's talk about Vital Hub. What is it and what does it do? Vital Hub is, uh, is a new company that's been formed for about a year now, and we focus in the healthcare software arena, primarily focused on the uh, mental health and the long term healthcare space. But there's two parts to our business one is uh, aggregation of existing companies that are looking to get more scale and more size. So we, we combine those together, and we've completed uh, already four little acquisitions uh, to date on that. And the other side that we've been working is an innovative blockchain solution for the similar space for the mental health and long-term care health space. Mm -hmm. And so what's the size of the long-term health, long-term mental health care space in Canada? Oh, they, you know, in the you know Canadian marketplace, there's about 3,000 uh, mental health facilities, and that doesn't include all the hospitals that have departmental solutions. So there's about a hot thousand institutional-based uh, stuff. So there's a marketplace of about 4,000 uh, locations that we would be servicing. That's only the Canadian marketplace. Uh, the one company that we just purchased uh, is already in the U.S. marketplace, and we already have a customer base there. So hmm. the U.S. marketplace is 10 times, uh, you know, our size. Uh, we have experience in internationally as well. I see. Okay. So what's the, how does it make money? Uh, we make money off of, so our primary business is in the electronic health record system and uh, auxiliary applications that get associated with that. So it's a recurring revenue stream that we would uh, get off of those existing uh, systems. So uh, we provide electronic health record systems for those spaces uh, and our annual use charges that would go through um, into those locations and ranges between 20000 to about 150000 per year that we would uh, be charging. Uh, the blockchain solution will be, you know, differently. It will be on a per user basis as users need to get access to those records on the blockchain system. Okay, so what are the features of the blockchain that are attractive and applicable for this particular? You know, blockchain is, uh, you know, it's new to everyone, but um, you know, we've embarked on that journey. We've taken our elite developers and we're, we're looking at building a blockchain solution on the Hyperledger-based platform. Uh, Hyperledger is is by far recognized for corporate use. Uh, they're building up a big healthcare-based initiative on that. And we're one of the early adopters in that particular based uh, arena. So, blockchain allows the one. There's lots of uses in healthcare, but the use that we're looking for is the interoperability of healthcare records, primarily focused on the space that we're involved with, the mental health and long-term care space, which is a huge issue within the, the healthcare sector. Yeah, sure. Okay. So, what's the uh, what's what's the revenue picture look like right now, and what's it going to look like twelve? months, 24 months out. You know, through all of our aggregations, uh, you know, we're a seven million dollar year company. We're only a year old. Uh, so we're already seven million in revenue, 200 plus customers uh, running across five different provinces already and into the U.S. marketplace. Uh, so we, we have a, a seven million dollar revenue stream that's coming in off of that. About 65 percent, that's recurring in nature. So we feel comfortable with that revenue mark. Uh, we're selling our existing solutions. Uh, so we're ramping up salespeople. So we expect and already are seeing some organic growth mm -hmm. uh, from those acquisitions. And as blockchain solutions come into the market, uh, we expect you know, some really good things to happen. Sure. So it's not profitable now then? When do you anticipate profitable? You know, we just put the, together these organizations. Um, of, of course, we're going to get some economies of scale as we start going through here. Our expectation is uh, that our M&A side of the business will be profitable in two to three quarters. Mm -hmm. That's where we're aiming towards getting to. Uh, blockchain initiative is a separate initiative, which we have uh, some costs of getting associated with that. Um, and as that particular grows and we start doing that, we may add more costs. We may not, uh, but we're we're exploring that. But th we're running it as two separate sides of the business right now. Sure. And so how do you drive sales? We have a direct sales strategy. So we have an experience. I'm, I, it's my background, per se. We have brought in a lot of uh, experienced salespeople into these organizations that didn't typically have sales before. So we're going to drive that through a, a very sophisticated direct sales channel. We also work very handily with partners so we we believe in working with uh, bigger consulting groups and, and other organizations to help uh, help you sell those solutions sure and what would you categorize as the target size of the company market cap wise call it five years out God, you know where we we think the sky's the limit for for this particular organization um, the blockchain initiative just on itself just an expandable is is it's a huge problem. So, um, and it's one of those things that can get viral and grow internationally in a you know fast period of time. But uh, five years, you know, if we're doing one acquisition a year, just with five six million, uh, you know, that's already going to be just aggregated as a forty fifty million dollar year company at that particular time. We expect that we can do more than that, but you know, conservatively uh, moving in that direction, uh, blockchain 
is a wild card. It could mm -hmm. be a 20, it could be a $60 million business in five years. So right. uh, we're working aggressively and trying to present to the investors a good opportunity with with some stability, a management team that knows what they're doing, a good install base on the M&A, but we really want the opportunity for explosive growth with blockchain as well. Okay. Let's leave it there for now. We'll come back to you in a couple quarters and see how you're making out. Thanks we're, for joining me. We're today. looking forward to it. Thanks for having me.